Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. We got ourselves a good one in the Pac-12 Women's Championship Tournament. Mighty Duck of Anaheim checking in. Welcome to the Sunday evening reaction between the UCLA Bruins and the underdogs, Washington State Cougars, who this past week stunned the world by getting a huge victory over the heavily favored Utah Uwees. This past week. And then UCLA Bruins women's team came back down 16 points to beat Stanford on Friday night. If you haven't seen that video, go check it out. You don't want to miss it. So here we go. The Bruins trying to get the ball. They do get it in. Washington stay. Here's a three on its way. No. Oh, 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 oh. Washington State got the ball. Wow. Wow. Dang. That ball was going around like a volleyball. Boom, 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 boom. Jeez. Wow. Dang. Even she, look, look at number five. She's like, she's like, I got the ball. I got the ball. I better get the ball. We got the ball. And the red's like, yeah. And she's like, all right, here you go. Here's the ball. We got it back though. 6.6 .6 seconds to go. Man, what a game. And if Washington State holds on to win this game, which most likely, Wow. Overall, 11 and 21, winless in the first Pac-12 tournament, seeking the first one in school history. Wow, this is unbelievable. Dang, this is definitely unbelievable. UCLA needs a miracle to tie this game to get it into overtime or something. Here we go. I'm gonna try and find fast. Wide open. Shoot. They do foul. Wow. Number one. Tyra Wallock. Uh, Tara Wallock. Oh, she missed one. Missed one. She missed them both. That gives UCLA a chance. And speaking about buzzer beaters and chances. Oh, she got it. She got it. Oh, man. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the earlier videos. A buzzer beater in the American Athletic Conference showdown between the Houston Cougars. Who are number one over uh, number one in the AP poll? They were playing against the Memphis Tigers in a tight one. The game was tied 65-65 in the final seconds, and then Houston had two timeouts remaining, and they're like, "Oh no, we're not using our timeout. We're just gonna drive down the court and take a shot." And they did. They took it and scored to defeat Memphis. At the buzzer to improve the record to 29 and 2. And then, all right, anything else in the tournaments? South Carolina women's win the SEC tournament. Virginia Tech women's defeat Louisville Cardinals to take the ACC tournament. So, hope you guys enjoyed that video Louisville versus Virginia Tech. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. And then another video, the Phoenix Suns took down the Dallas Mavericks in an NBA Sunday showcase. Things got a little physical and chippy between Devin Booker and Luka Doncic. Definitely um, flashbacks of the 2022 playoffs. 
When the Suns got cooked in that game in Game 7, they got destroyed. Indiana Pacers defeat the Chicago Bulls 125-122. to If I was Washington State, do not foul if they shoot a three. Here we go. Do not foul. UCLA ball. Los Angeles Lakers defeat the Golden State Warriors 113 to 105. And Stephen Curry's return, but wasn't enough to beat the Lakers. And the last time I took a look, Indiana, Michigan, Big Ten showdown. It went into overtime. Last time I took a look, Indiana was leading 75 to 73. Here we go. They got a shoot. Oh, no. And that does it. Washington State has done it. The long wait is over. They have stunned the Pac-12 world. As they win their first ever Pac-12 tournament championship. Oh, my. And UCLA is stunned. Uh, we all are shocked. Nobody predicted them to be in this position. It was either going to be Stanford, Utah, or UCLA. They came out of nowhere. It, this is March basketball, baby. Wow, congratulations to the Washington State Cougars on winning their first ever Pac-12 tournament. UCLA fans, keep your heads up. Wow. We'll see you on the next one. This is great. Woo! <laughs> wow, this is more, um, how can I put this? More watchable than the Iowa Hawkeyes versus Ohio State game. That game was a total blowout. At halftime, Iowa Hawkeyes, Kevin Clark was just balling like crazy. She was just shooting them threes from way downtown. They were leading Ohio State. 61 to 24. Wow. All right. I got to stop talking. This is just unbelievable. I'll see you guys.